My Programmatic Art The Tate Modern in London, the Museum of Modern Art in New York, and the Los Angeles County Museum of Art have all added galleries dedicated to the display of art made by computers. In the art world, which has a notorious aversion to change, programmatic art has become a staple. From the abstract canvases of Scott Lazar and the complex webs of algorithms by David Medaya, to the generative works of artists like Jeff Koons and the digital collages of Mariko Mori, programmatic art has become a way for the art world to explore the future. In the same way, the music world has been quick to embrace the possibilities of AI. The art world is no longer the sole domain of painters and sculptors. Today, a wide variety of media are used to create art and exhibit it, including computer programs. So-called programmatic art is the use of computer algorithms to create artwork. This can range from a computer that generates abstract images to a digital painting app that allows users to choose colors and brush sizes. Being a successful artist has always been about having the right connections. For centuries, the world's most powerful collectors and curators were those with the most money. Today, the most powerful artists are those with the best connections to the biggest collectors and the most influential curators. In the art world, the word networking is used as a euphemism for the hard work of cultivating the relationships that will pay off. In the past, artists have worked in a variety of mediums to create their art. Painters use paint, sculptors use clay, and so on. Today, however, the definition of an artist has changed. Programmatic art, which is the use of code to create art, is a prime example of this. Today, one of the most powerful tools that artists have to create art is the computer. Programmatic art, or generative art, refers to the use of code to produce artwork. It's a new mode of aesthetic creation. Programmatic art is the art of programming. I like to make art from the words I love. I like to make art from the words that I am thinking about. I like to tell stories with the words that I like or need to consider. Programmatic art is created by programming computers to generate artwork. The images created directly from text can take on surprising forms. A program that generates fractals could create shapes that resemble plants or animals. A program that generates abstract images could produce paintings, collages, or even music. Computer algorithms can be used to create artwork that looks nothing like the art that humans create. Instead of using paint to create shapes on a canvas, algorithms can be used to generate images directly from text. This opens up a variety of possibilities for artwork. The images created directly from text can take on surprising forms. Like any artist, my goal as a creator is to create compelling images. I like to experiment with different styles and mediums, and I like to push the boundaries of what is possible. My images arise from trying to create something new and different, and hopefully compelling to those who see them. I create programmatic art because I want to tell stories with the words that I like or need to consider. I like to create images that arise from trying to create something new and different, and hopefully compelling to those who see them. I like to think that my images are beautiful and compelling, but I'm not sure that others will agree. I'm okay with that.